Hey, I um, wanted to come to you live, but I am up here and I don't have a lot of service. So I pre-recorded this and wanted to share with you how this 645 Not So Hard Challenge is going. So I just came up that right there and down below is to my husband, it's not much, but this like rock kind of step up section. And there's a couple others on the trail on the way up that since we've moved here a few years ago, I have never ridden. I've watched my now eight year old son ride it every time. But me, I'm like, nope, I just get off and I'm cool with pushing my bike over. And just yesterday I rode two of them for the first time. And today I rode all three. And I gotta tell you, it is just the best feeling. And so where this comes from and why I wanna share it with you is just, I challenged myself and I challenged my wellness community with this 645 not so hard challenge and it has these things that we're doing um, some of them for some of us we might already have them as habits and be doing them or they're not that hard to implement into our everyday real lives um, but it's just about showing ourselves it's not so hard to do for ourselves and to remind ourselves of that and then some of the challenges they might be some and it's like, gosh, okay, that truly is a challenge for me. And my initial reaction is, that's hard. I can't do it. There's no way. I don't have the time. I don't have the ability. Um, I just don't feel like it today. That's what I was feeling about this bike ride today. I was about ready to say no because I was feeling totally spent. And then I was like, nope, it's a challenge. I'm Part of our challenge is to get outside for at least 15 minutes and do something active every day. And so I came out here and it's just showing me when you show up for yourself consistently and you challenge yourself with just little things, they don't need to be major and they can fit into your everyday real life. Like just 15 minutes getting outside, just a 30 minute workout at home, just drinking water, just following a nutrition plan that fits with your whole family. Then all of a sudden things start lining up. You start to just feel really good about yourself. You start to feel this confidence and you start to feel this glow when you see it, when you look in the mirror and then you're on the trail and you're screaming, way to go mommy. <laughs> That's my thing I do. So um, that is what doing something like this 645 not so hard challenge does for you. It adds up so quickly so that you are then like, okay, you know what I'm doing for myself and now I'm gonna, I can take on whatever life has for me at work and you know at home and the fun things too because they all do add up but if you aren't taking care of you first then we miss the beats of everything that is happening so um yeah there's so much more to it of course but i think this is vital for all of us whether we are staying at home with our kiddos especially if you're somebody who's like me and you're an entrepreneur and we can, i here's one of the reasons i didn't want to come out today i was like okay i already took time to do my workout this morning i took time to if you saw my stories today um rearrange our bedroom i did those sort of like things around the house and then i was like i've got work to do um i don't have time to get outside right now and my legs are spent i just the excuses were piling up but i was like my wellness community they're showing up and we set this challenge i've got to get out there and look what happens when you do you go oh my god way to go mommy so the next um, not so hard, well, not so hard, 645 not so hard challenge is gonna be starting the first week of August. And gosh, I hope you join us. It would be so awesome. All right, gotta head back down the trail now.